Hey guys, welcome to another video. Alan Roy here. I hope everyone is doing okay today. Hola amigos, bienvenidos a otro video. Su amigo Alan saludándoles. With the channel of Elegante Aroma. <laughs> Con el canal de Elegante Aroma. Well, last year right around this time we lost a really good friend, a family member. A massive void is in the community ever since we lost this person. Alan Alvarez. His channel is Elegante Aroma. Alan unfortunately passed away at a very young age last year in a traffic accident, leaving behind a wife and daughter. And it really hit the community really hard. And just before I filmed this video, because I filmed so many takes, I have to take a step back and pray to Alan to help me get through it because I don't like speaking about him because it really does bring a lot of pain because I, that, that's how much I miss him. I had to ask him to help me get through this video because he's left that kind of impact on me but other people as well. Alan was a really gentle soul. He was happy. He was always happy in his videos. He was positive. Even if he didn't like a fragrance, he didn't bash it. He was blunt, but he always said it with a smile. And there is that empty void in the community because he's gone. Every now and then I'll go back to Alan's channel just to see some of his videos. And every single time that I do, it never fails. My eyes do water up. And I do get goosebumps because just a few weeks before his passing, I was actually on the phone with him. Uh, I forget what we spoke about. Fragrances and family, of course. But we talked everything under the sun, sometimes even for an hour when he was at work. And he was always working. So, But he always had time for his family and he always put a little time away aside for reviewing. And he always did his videos in his car. That's, that's why. But Alan, I do miss you, I do love you, and I have a hard time telling men that I love them, even if they're very close to me, just because that's not a masculine thing to do, but I do love you, amigo, I terribly miss you, you're still on my Facebook, and that will never change. I know I'm not alone when I say this, but you are missed, and cherished, and you will always be remembered, and that's all I'm going to say because... I probably dragged this on long enough, and there's definitely other people that do want to say something. So I'll never forget you, amigo, and I love you. Chad, thank you for asking me to do this. Uh, I just want to say our hearts are all still broken for your family, and obviously the YouTube fragrance community and people who love you miss you, uh, Alan, and thankfully for us, you still live on through the videos on your channel and I wanted to shoot this in a car because most of the videos I've watched from you have you in the car and uh, we miss you. This is my dedication video to Alan Alvarez from Elegante Aroma, a member of the fragrance community who tragically passed away a year ago. Back before I was a fragrance reviewer myself, there were certain reviewers that I would watch pretty regularly. Red Alessence, Robes 08, Jeremy Fragrance, a Gentleman's Journey. But there was one video I watched two years ago and it was the top 10 most complimented fragrances. It was actually done by Alan himself. That video alone would help eventually convince me to suck it up and buy B-Man already because <laughs> Alan ranked it number two on that list and said he got all kinds of compliments when he was doing his bachata dancing. <laughs> and I love the bachata dance too, so. In the grand scheme of things, the Frag Com, it's pretty small. Borderline family status. And with all this kind of petty shit that's been happening in our community that I've been a part of as well. This puts things into perspective, man. This is no longer about he said, she said. This is, this is a guy's life. And in almost an instant, he was gone. So it just goes to show you what's really important in this life. Life is precious. Cherish every single moment. Whatever other cliche you can think of, it's true, man. It's so true. Love honestly conquers all. So I'm sending my love to you, Alan. My thoughts are with your family and your friends and your loved ones. I'm also sending love to the whole fragrance community because honestly, guys, we're all stronger together. Thanks for letting me share this message, Chad, in loving memory of Alan Alvarez. Hello, 
fragrance community, uh, community. That's a huge word when it comes to, to videos like this. You know, uh, Chad, I can't thank you enough for letting me be a part of this. Alan Alvarez, you are so missed in our, in our fragrance world. Uh, trust me when I say that. Uh, you know, you always just had that smile. You, you could tell when you were talking about a fragrance, you were just happy, you know, and, and you made us very happy. And we, we do truly miss you. Um, you know, your, your fragrance reviews in your car, uh, the Spanish reviews, you know, you just took, took a lot of things to that next level. And, you know, I still appreciate your videos. I will go back and look at some of your videos. I'm so glad that your channel's still there. Uh, you know, uh, like I said, you'll, you'll, be, you'll be missed, you know, and, and you are missed. So, Alan, uh, you know, this, this video is just, it's just great. And um, it's hard to believe it's been a year already. But, um, you know, uh, just, you know, it's, yeah, it's, it's all I can really say. But, uh, you know, we, we do miss you. And it just, uh, I would have loved to have known you as just a just a person uh, for you know your family and and friends and, and all that you know I, I know our community is is big and I never got to meet you but just by by watching your videos and, and your personality uh, I just know you were just a, a great family man and um, you just ca cared about a lot of people and you got a big heart so Alan this video is uh, it is so great Chad thank you so much again for putting this together um, you know thanks so much and I'm just so happy to be a part of this fragrance community. We are a very strong community and I'd love to keep it that way. So uh, talk to you guys soon. Rise Frags 34. We love you, Alan. Take care. Thanks, Chad, for asking me to do this. Uh, my heart goes out to the family and friends closest to Alan. Uh, oftentimes with these moments of loss, you don't know what to say. And so I opened up uh, one of my few book books of poems and it opened to this page and I just took it as serendipity that maybe I should read this. This is a poem by John Updike entitled Perfection Wasted. And another regrettable thing about death is the ceasing of your own brand of magic which took a whole life to develop and market. The quips, the witticisms, the slant adjusted to a few. Those loved ones nearest the lip of the stage. Their soft faces blanched at the footlight glow their laughter close to tears, their tears confused with their own diamond earrings, their warm pooled breath in and out with your heartbeat, their response and your performance twinned. The jokes over the phone, the memories packed in the rapid access file, the whole act. Who will do it again? That's it. No one. Imitators and descendants aren't the same. We miss you, Alan. Alan, who was such a good friend of mine. Um, I would never forget that he was uh, my very first subscriber, my very first support into my YouTube channel. Uh, he helped me out a lot, uh, like adding me into those um, fragrance groups and such, such and so. And uh, um, I, he was one of those guys that he's very uh, serviable, which is like very uh, helpful. He loves to help people, and he was always very nice and very warm. Um, I love his channel. Uh, I think um, exploring niche, such a great title, such a great segment. Um, he was exploring niche, and uh, he was um, like reviewing niche fragrances every day of what samples of what he tried. Um, I, I got a few things off him because of his recommendations. One of the things that he really loved and he highly recommended to me was Sand Oud. This is going to be my center of day today for you, Alan. For Alan Alvarez. He was such a funny guy as well. I would never forget the fact that his family used to kick him out from the living room. And he used to shoot his videos in the kitchen and he like he used to be like really bummed about that i thought it was so funny one more thing um uh green thumb he was um, a fragrance reviewer at a time john howard shout out to him um alan he used to have an accent just like me and uh he was talking i forgot the actual content of the video but he was talking about green thumb and he said it like of I thought he said green tooth and uh, we were uh, kind of like uh, uh, making fun of him or like kind of like teasing him because of what he said 
uh, and he was like, hey guys, I swear I said green thump. And uh, we, we thought it was so funny, so hilarious. He was such a nice guy. He was quick with it too. He, like his videos were like one shot, no editing, take it the way it is. And he all, used to always throw the funniest thing throughout. Um, we really miss you, Alan, and we love you. And I'm pretty sure uh, you're watching us from heaven and uh, you, you're happy for that. Um, and for everybody out there, please uh, um, just go to Elegante Aroma, Alan's, Alan's channel, and uh, comment in his last video something. I'm pretty sure he would be happy for that. What's up, guys? This is Maynard. I'm from the channel Undisputed Fragate. I want to thank to Gentleman's Journey channel, Chad, for having me being a part of this. And, you know, last year we lost Alan Alvarez from the Elegante Roma channel. We lost him, uh, you know, it's pretty sad because the fragrance community is so big and there's so much love in it. And when something like this happens, you lose a brother. It, it's, it hurts. You know, I just want to be a part of this and just, you know, pray that wherever his soul is, you know, it's in peace. And I want to like just pray for his family because it's very hard to lose a member, you know. And I don't, that, that, that's it guys. I mean, I, I just want to say I miss him. And another thing I want to add is like I said, I was a big fan of him, and I knew he, you know, he, he loved this fragrance. Uh, so Alan loved this fragrance, if you guys have been following him. And I bought this because of his recommendation. A lot of people don't talk about this. Every time, if you know about fragrances, it, it has a, you know, every scent has a memory. Every time I wear this fragrance, it reminds me of him like what a great person he was what a great, great taste he had and it feels like man you know i bought it because of that guy and he's no more and it kind of hurts i mean i was a big fan can't help it right so just wanted to be a part of this and just want to wish all the best to his family and just want to you know wish all the best to his soul with you know so that was it guys uh peace i knew Alan Alvarez through Facebook. He was part of my Facebook group when I did have one piece love perfume and he did a lot of collabs with me. I didn't know him more than that, but he was always a very friendly person, always a nice word to say, never any drama with that guy. And when we all found out that he passed away so suddenly, so tragically, we were all pretty devastated. Even if you didn't know him more than Facebook, he was a loving, gentle soul, as you can definitely tell by his videos and such a shame that a good man like that has to be taken from us so suddenly. Chad, it is with great love and pleasure that I submit this to your very, very thoughtful and heartfelt tribute to Alan. Take care, everyone. What's up, Chad? It's your boy, Rome 300. Uh, I wanna thank you for allowing me to be in this tribute collaboration. I uh, wanted to send my condolences and also my prayers out to Alan Alvarez's family. Um, he was a fellow fragrance reviewer. Um, and I wanted just to say our prayers always with you. We know that you are resting in peace in heaven and we miss you. Um, I didn't actually get an opportunity to meet uh, Alan um, in person, but I did watch his videos and enjoyed them. So I wanted to say to a fellow fragrance reviewer and fragrance head, uh, God bless, rest in peace, and um, yeah, we miss you. Peace. Hello, fragrance community. My name is Matt Fragrance Martin. Before I go ahead and say what I have to say, I just want to say a big, big thank you to Chad for, you know, I, re I think really putting this video together. I think anybody who is taking part in this collaboration will agree with me that what Chad is doing is absolutely amazing. And um, yeah, I mean, Chad, you're awesome. The one thing we want to do and would love to do all the time is to review fragrances and wear fragrances. So that's why it saddens me to, you know, really talk about um, 
you know, Alan Alvarez. I didn't know him personally. I was very aware that he was a YouTuber and I know that he was very respected by a lot of people in the community. And it saddens me, to be honest, because obviously he, you know, he's no longer with us. And I, it, it hurts me because I wish I could have gotten to know him. After seeing all his videos, I could tell that he was a, you know, a very well-spirited person, somebody who loved his fragrances, somebody that loved to do videos. So yeah, it does sad me because I didn't know him on a personal level, but, but I think deep down, what hurts more than anything is the fact that, you know, it, it is like losing a brother. Even though I didn't know him personally, it is like losing a brother because for anyone here on YouTube, who, you guys are my brothers, you guys are my sisters, you guys are my best friends, you know? And I feel like I, I have lost a brother because he shared a passion, you know? And it's the same passion I have, so it hurts. It really hurts, but, um, you know, rest in peace, Alan. I'm sorry I didn't know you personally, buddy, but, um, you know, I'm, I'm sure that wherever you are right now, buddy, you can smell way better than all of us down here. Thank you, Alan, and uh, thank you so much, Chad, for giving me the chance to do this, buddy. Thank you. Now let's get on to the next person. Hey guys, Ashton with 10 Cents. Chad, thanks for inviting me on this remembrance video. Unfortunately, I never got to speak one-on-one -on -one with Alan. Pretty much everything I know about him is from other people and the videos that I've watched. Everything that I've seen about him says that he was a great guy, and I'm really bummed that I never got the opportunity to speak to him. It's a really crazy thing how quickly uh, life can change or how quickly your life can be taken away. Because he was actually younger than I am when he died. And that's hard for me to even think about really. So I'm looking forward to seeing this video come together, maybe learning some more about him from other people that had an opportunity to have him in their life. But I think if nothing else, Maybe this would be a good time for the fragrance community in general, uh, reviewers or prominent people on forums or Facebook groups to be a little more introspective and maybe cut down on some of this uh, hate that seems to be uh, becoming more and more prevalent. Rest in peace, Alan. I'm sorry that I never got to meet you. I'm sure we would have been good friends. Hi everyone, this is Lander Smith from Sense Memory and I'm going to say a few things about Alan Alvarez, and I'm saying it inside my car because um, Alan did so many wonderful reviews inside his car. Um, I watched Alan grow from the very beginning, and we had a great connection, a great personal co connection, and I encouraged him, and he encouraged me, and we... We just developed this really sweet and wonderful relationship. He was much more than a, a YouTube fragrance reviewer. He was a friend, a friend to many of us. And um, I miss him and I think about him quite often. So, Alan, vaya con Dios, my friend. What's going on, everybody? Al here. Street Sense. I had to do this. Alan Alvarez would want me to do this. My little intro for you. I know you're watching from heaven, Alan Alvarez, what a great guy, part of the fragrance community, part of the family. He passed away a year ago, tragic car accident, and it was like we lost a family member. It was sad, it was a sad week in the fragrance community, sad month when I heard he passed away. I was literally depressed, I was upset. I never met Alan Alvarez in person, but I felt like I knew the guy for years. He sent me some messages, we went back and forth, he told me how much of a fan he was of Street Sense, and I told him I was a fan of his channel as well. So I felt like I knew the guy for so long, and he lit up the, the screen with his videos. His uh, passion for fragrances was there, you could see it. And he did videos in Spanish, and he was just you know doing his thing, and I respect that. So my condolences are to his family, if you're watching. Alan, we miss you, you're not forgotten. I'll see you later. Hello, I'm George, but on YouTube I'm known as The Fragrance Apprentice. I wanted to go ahead and say thank you to Chad for asking and inviting me and uh, others like me to come and speak on this video. It's very appreciated and it's good that Chad has brought us all together for this. I didn't actually know um, Alan Alvarez uh, in person and I only really actually saw um, his final few videos, but I was really getting into what he was doing. He was obviously a very friendly and lovely person and although I didn't know him too well it was an absolute shock and 
tragedy when I found out that he uh, had passed away in very tragic circumstances. Um, I can't really offer too much apart from to say to the rest of his family that uh, you have my condolences, my thoughts are with you, uh, of course, and please know that Alan is remembered extraordinarily fondly uh, in this community and he will always be remembered uh, in this community. Um, so that's really everything I've got to say and um, again thank you to everybody who has come forward to say things uh, about Alan. Hey guys, sad day today. Um, it's been nearly a year since the passing of a great man, Mr. Alan Alvarez. Uh, I thought I'd shoot this video in my truck uh, in memory of the fact that the man would shoot his videos in his car. Uh, he would he would take time out of his day whenever he had a chance to go over a new fragrance and uh, he always made sure to put everything he had into it and uh, he made sure everyone was involved which is why he did both Hispanic versions and non-Hispanic versions. Guys, just, just remember life is short, guys, and uh, don't take people for granted. Don't take family, friends, and loved ones for granted for sure, but even as simple as it can be, don't take reviewers for granted, guys, because you never know when you could lose somebody who you, you spent a lot of time watching and actually show some care towards. So, um, Alan, man, if you can hear this, if you can watch this guy, thank you for inspiring me and fellow reviewers to uh, give from our hearts. And uh, I appreciate you, man. Much love. Rest in peace. Hey, guys. I'm Carlos. This is Adrian. Hi. And I just want to be part of uh, Alan's uh, remembrance. And I just want to say that we as men, while we only live in this world when we die, is uh, the education we give our, ch we gave our children the weight our word carried when we spoke and the memories of those who really knew us and how much uh, they loved us and we loved them. And if you go back to Alan's videos or you ask anybody who knew him, you know that he left his part of the world. And I need to tell you that uh, nature abhors a void and he left a void. And I also need to ask who's gonna step in and fill the void. Necesitamos a alguien que hable en español that they reviews and who's gonna do it we need great men here there's great people already on youtube we need more so this is my part and i say bye thank you very much bye bye what's up guys this is jay copeland from stay fresh productions chad thank you so much for allowing me to be a part of this eulogy video um i understand that it's been about a year since uh, we lost a fellow reviewer and member of the community, Alan Alvarez. I remember I probably discovered Alan's channel and his videos maybe a month before he passed. I, I had just come across his channel and I was really enjoying his reviews. Just a very genuine and sincere spirit, easy to, to listen to and very enjoyable. And it was just kind of crazy to me. It was a big shock. I had just this, you know, I had just come across him and then all of a sudden he's gone and it's kind of crazy so um, i did want to send my condolences and my best and my prayers to his family and all of his loved ones i know the fragrance community deeply misses him and we wish we could uh, still get his taste and his voice on fragrances um, but pray that he's resting well and uh, that he's with the angels and uh, that's all i have to say Thank you guys so much for watching. On to the next one. Thank you, Chad, for putting this uh, together. Uh, this reinforces my notion that you're a great pillar in this community. So about a year ago, we lost Alan, and then this impacted me um, a lot, actually. Uh, there are only two people that saw me or were aware of how this impacted me for three days. I kept rethinking things. Um, discussed this a lot with my girlfriend. She saw me go through... Uh, those thought processes and conversation with her and then the other guy is a great friend that i made through this community just an amazing guy um so this event impacted me um a lot and then for the better 
I was really sad, but it made me rethink a lot of things or reinforce some of the pillars that I use in my life to guide me maybe during high or low periods of my life. And I want to share a couple of those aspects with you. I didn't personally know him, but I watch a lot of his uh, videos. Um, his laugh was infectious. Um, really great guy, happy, um, bubbly personality there. Um, so uh, focusing on the way this impacted me. So the first pillar is positivity. So um, this is a hobby first of all. So I don't spend too much time worrying about what other people are saying or being part of drama. I think it is not worth the time. Uh, the positive thing here is I just want to share my experience and then learn from others. That's what I enjoy the most. So I try, try to stay away from drama as much as I can. And then uh, positive thoughts usually boost you uh, while uh, negative thoughts usually get you stuck at a level until you can push on to somebody else and then if you get into the habit of building that all you're doing is build this nasty personality that needs to feed off of other people's uh, suffering uh, if you will while happy thoughts just boost you naturally uh, the second thing that I want to touch about is how important your friends and family are. The support system that is around you, easy to ignore that they're already there. Focus on external stuff that are uh, pretty much volatile if you want to think about it. And then um, ignore that support system that boosts you up, builds you up uh, there when you need them. Um, quietly, they actually forge you. And then that support system is important to uh, focus on that because as a human being it allows you to build up somebody else, to impact somebody else positively. Um, make something out of your life before you leave this um, existence here. So these are the two things that I wanna um, share with you guys. Um, a really good reminder, and then for me, is a revalidation of what I believe in um, a year from now where uh, this event happened. Hey, what's up YouTube? Uh, Israel here from Dollars and Cents. Uh, thanks Chad for inviting me on this compilation uh, video. Uh, to pay our respects uh, to our good friend Alan Alvarez who passed away last year. Um, he was one of the good ones uh, from the uh, um, from the YouTube community, the fragrance community, from Fragcom. Very nice guy. I had an opportunity to talk with him a few times. We had some pretty long conversations on Facebook. He sent me a bunch of uh, samples, and um, and we just talked, you know, quite a bit. And you know, I, just very very all around nice guy. I believe he was married and had a daughter as well. Um, just breaks my heart that he had to he had to leave us so soon, um, but I know he's in a better place, and so um, I'm just here to pay my respects to Alan Alvarez, one of the good ones, and I uh, hope you're doing well, my friend, and I will see you again one day. Uh, Chad, thank you again for having me on this video, and um, just uh, you know, just wanted to pay my respects to my good friend Al Alan Alvarez. Rest in peace, my friend. Hey there, Manny from the Cascade Scents Fragrance Station. And it's been a minute, or sorry, specifically a year, that this angel has been taken from us. And I'm gutted still that that has happened. Alan, we miss you. Uh, thank you for all you've done for this community. And I know uh, you're a loving family man, and uh, you loved this community, and we loved you back for it. I'm gutted that I didn't get the opportunity to get to know you or work with you as much as your peers at the time. And I just want to let you know that you are a pioneer within this community. I think it was super cool for you to do fragrance reviews in both Spanish and English. And it actually motivates me to get in touch with my personal heritage uh, to maybe do something like that one day on Cascade Sense. Uh, that being said, this is all about you, brother, and I hope you're well wherever you are. Much love. Hi, everyone. So I remember when Alan passed away about a year ago, and it was a real shock. I was a subscriber to his channel, and I'd only been watching his video, uh, one of his videos, a day or two before it happened. So it was really shocking. I didn't know him well, but we had commented on each other's videos. And uh, I always enjoyed his, his relaxed and fun style. I remember him, he made me laugh once when he said that a co-worker said 
that when he wore 24 gold, it, he thought that he was going to give him diabetes because it was so sweet. And it was also really good that he did a lot of his videos, I think all of them, in English and Spanish, which much of, you know, imagine how much work it took to repeat the whole thing in another language. So a great guy and really, really sad that he's not with us anymore, but he hasn't been forgotten. And I think we know up there in heaven, somewhere there's a corner that's smelling great because Alan's up there. And uh, on to the next person. Hey ladies and gentlemen, and thank you for tuning in. I wanted to make this video for my friend Chad, uh, talking about a dear friend of the community who passed away about a year ago. Uh, his name was Alan Alvarez, and he is survived by his wife and his daughter. Um, I have to be honest in saying that Alan and I never really interacted on a personal level. Um, he might have commented on my videos, and I'm sure I probably commented on a bunch of his. Um, but he did pass away suddenly last year, and it kind of left a bit of a void in the community for a while. And I'm very upset that things like this happen, but um, I just want to offer my best wishes to his family. And I think Alan's legacy will remain here on YouTube. And that's one of the beauties of making videos on YouTube is that your videos are archived and they'll be here for a long time. So people can tune into them and they can remember you and who you are. And I just know that from the impression that I got of Alan that he was a great person and I'm very happy to have had the opportunity to interact with him while he was still around. Um, I know that he is in a better spot now, so my sincerest condolences and my warmest wishes go out to Alan and his family. So thank you guys for tuning in. I hope you're having a wonderful day. Hi YouTube, hola YouTube. Uh, we're here honoring the memory of Alan Alvarez, a beloved YouTuber that used to review both in English and Spanish. I had the opportunity to do the last collaboration with him. Unfortunately, the week that he passed is when we uploaded the video. He never got to see the final product. Uh, Alan, donde estés, I'm sure you're in heaven. Um, my heart goes out to, to, to familia, tu esposa, Marisol y tu linda niña. Uh, I know you are uh, in the hands of uh, Jesus in, in, in the skies. Uh, miss you, bro. Thank you. guys please do yourself a, a favor keep us smelling good all the time see you in another video god bless you all gracias chicos eh, chicas eh, chicas chicos este gracias por ver el video eh, rico todo el tiempo por favor y nos vemos en la próxima que dios los bendiga bye bye